Better at ranking, man. Better at ranking, man. We got another one. We got another one. Fire, fire, battle. Salute the Swave, man. Salute the um, B Dot, man. Rank number 25, Swave, versus rank number 43, B Dot, man. Fire, 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 battle. Close, close battle. If I see anybody say 3-0 clear either way, and I'm hearing a lot of 3-0s, B-Dot, and I understand that. I definitely understand that because B-Dot was more consistent in this battle when it comes to, in terms of, um, like, back-to-back -back punches rapping consistently. Like, sometimes Swave in each one of his rounds was, like, stumbling over his words, and he'll stop. And he'll go to a hold and he'll forget that and go to this place and forget that and go to this place. But that's just his style. That's just his style, you know what I'm saying? So B Dot looked more polished and consistent, but like when it comes in terms of what I just explained, but overall, nah man. Swave went second. He was fighting every round. I like what Swave was doing every round. B dot comes out first in the first round, doing his thing. I'm talking about fire, man. And he was fire, consistent. They had a conversation too, y'all. The conversation was real. It's like they knew what each other was gonna say. It's like they knew what each other was gonna say, and it was fire. It was definitely having a conversation with each other, man. And um, I don't know who won the conversation. Like I definitely was understanding B dot's um point of view. I definitely was understanding Swave's point of view too. I was rocking with both of the point of views. It was crazy. So they was that was a draw right there for me in the conversation. But like I like I said, the first round B dot definitely was doing his thing. Came out fire, spazzing. Swave come back, doing his thing, doing his thing. Got the crowd right back. Show that he's seasoned. Show that he's a vet. Swave, salute the Swave. Showing a lot of people couldn't do that coming out the fire round like that. He turned the crowd around like from the beginning of his rounds. The way he he do his rounds is fire. Like he ended each one of his rounds in a certain type of um certain type of way. Fire. And then the beginning of his rounds, he get the crowd right back. Fire. Black power, black, black, you know what I'm saying? The Wakanda, like, I'm going to strip your powers, like, his endings and his beginnings of his rounds is showing how seasoned he is. Oh, yeah, another thing with B-Dot, man, I'm seeing what you're doing, B-Dot. I'm seeing what you're doing. That performance, that performance, you're stepping your performance up a lot of time. you just kind of um, stiff with it. Using your delivery to carry you through and your um your flow and your delivery to carry you through, but you was all over that stage, man. All over that stage. Salute to you. You wanted that space. Can I get some space? Can I get some space? Yeah, I see you. I see you. Salute to you for definitely stepping up your performance, man. Um, but like I said, Swave came in doing his thing. He got a whole different type of style. Yes, it takes him a little while to get to his punches, but he's still rhyming. He multi rhyming, and he's getting there. He's getting there, and he's doing little slick punches, little slick jabs in between. I actually like what Sway was doing. I actually like. I edged this first round to B dot though. I definitely edged this first round to B dot, but Sway, it was debatable. It was debatable. I want to give it to Swave because Swave ended up getting the crowd all the way back to have B Dot having to fight back. Like B Dot was like, okay, okay. By the end of the first round, he like, okay, I gotta do my thing now. He knew the pressure was back on him. The pressure was back on him. Oh yeah, Swave is here to fight. So I want to give Swave that round just cause that, and I know a lot of people probably will give him. Once it come back out and everybody get to actually see it and the hype is dead. But, um, yeah, um, B-Dot definitely came out in this, like, I gave B-Dot the edge, B-Dot the first round. B-Dot came out in the second round. Second round, his energy wasn't as good as the first round. He trying to get the crowd back because I told you, Swave took the crowd. He took the crowd in the first round, so B-Dot's trying to get the crowd back in the second. Try to, and he got it. You know, it didn't take him long. He got it. He was doing his thing. Back on it, back on it. By the time in the middle, towards the end, he was on fire again. Fire had the crowd again and fire again. But like I said, he had his the, the little 
It wasn't a drop spot because it was consistent. He was consistent all three rounds. You know what I'm saying? So no drop spot. But he wasn't, like, he didn't carry on the momentum from his first straight into the second. No, it took a while for him to get the crowd back and then he started doing his thing. But he definitely did his thing. Swave in his second round. Grabbed the crowd right back. Right back in the beginning of the second. Vets, that vet stuff. That vet, I don't like to use the family. That vet stuff, man. That vet stuff got the crowd right back in the second round and start doing his thing. Yes, Swave had a couple of stumbles, but B Dot also had a stumble. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if it was the same round, but when I do the stumbles, like it's no choke, so you don't automatically lose the round. But with the stumbles, it's kind of like your overall performance. So B Dot had a, a, a worse stumble than Swave was doing. He had little stumbles, but he grabbed it right back and do what he had to do. The only thing with Swave, I don't know if I said it or not, but Swave is more like he's jumping from subject to subject to subject. He's like overall, he's he's making sense, but he's like B dot's kind of just going right through his raps, so it's just seen consistent overall. So I can see why people probably saying three yo, but and it's taking um Swave several a, a little longer to get there, but he's getting there. And I actually like what Swave was doing in that second better man. I actually like what Swave was doing in that second better. I ended up giving Swave the second round, man. Swave ended up getting, um, I ended up giving Swave the second round. I think he did enough to take that second round from B Dot, man. In my opinion, a very, very debatable. All the rounds was debatable. I mean, the clearest round was this third because, um, like I said, Swave did a little bit more um, stumbling a little bit. But and it seemed like he lost the crowd a little bit. But I, I like what he was doing in the third too. He was actually talking to B Dot, man. Like you gotta take everything for what it's worth. I take everything for what it's worth and try to put myself in their shoes. And he was talking to B Dot. B Dot, you know, he won't deny him too much. He even admitted that the dude he was that was a good angle, just not accurate. But you know what I'm saying? The defense from both players was pretty good. Pretty good. I like the um Swave Service defense a little bit better. A little bit better because sometimes B Dot wasn't really paying attention to the rhymes. But then even though when Swave is talking that real stuff, you still act like you're not listening. So I don't know, like it kinda of throwing me off a little bit. But the third round is definitely the clearest round to me. B Dot got that third. So B Dot ended up winning the battle two one to me. The first and the third. But the first is very, very, very debatable to me. I want to watch it one more time, but I'm going to give it to But it doesn't affect anything. I'm going to wait to the consistency to move them up and down the rankings. You know, I wait for the um, consistency. So that's what we're going to do, man. Fire battle. Salute the Swave. Salute the B-Dot, man. Fire, fire, fire battle, man. When it come out, I already know how it's going to get numbers when it come out by itself. When it come out on YouTube by itself, oh, she gonna get numbers. This gonna get debated, man. This gonna get debated. Like I said, um, Swave, I don't know if I said it or not, but Swave was more humorous. He took the humorous type angles. You know what I'm saying? He'd jump out of it, but he'd still try to be a little humorous. B Dot won't play him. He was serious almost the whole time. I don't even think he said one joke. He might have said something like something funny but he wasn't saying it in a joking matter so he was serious the whole time he definitely got his point across Swave definitely got his point across they both won they both won nobody loses in the rankings nobody loses in the rankings but i'm gonna wait for the consistent just give a winner man battle rap rankings man battle rap is like i see everything y'all stay on your a game man holla at me one